Hi guys, Jostein from yourdino.com here. So today I'm going to talk about support for external environmental sensors. So this can be useful if the Yordyno box sits inside a cabinet for example, or if you want to measure the environmental conditions very close to the intake of your engine. So this unit here from Dracal called PTH200 measures humidity, temperature and pressure and the tip of the of the cable here this has about a, a meter of length of a cable then you can put any USB cable uh, length you want it costs about $75 and you can see the, the specifications here they uh, they are very uh, good and uh, I'll show you how this is supported in your dyno so before you start using the sensor with the, the dyno software you need to download the sensor software so that's this uh, piece here Q10Key data logger and um, if you go here there are links and downloads and you take uh, this piece here Qtanky install uh, and you just uh, install it uh, just follow the standard procedures and uh, you're done so the sensors are supported as a plugin so you can go and manage plugins you go browse and download plugins at yourdino.com just as any other plugin and you will now see this plugin here PTH 200 and then you go to download and here you can see both the DLL file that's the plugin you can also see the source code if you want to take a look or if you want to make support for your own environmental sensors you can use this as an example but we'll use the, the DLL for now okay and then it is downloaded we'll go back to your dyno and install it and it is installed in it was downloaded in the downloads area and it's here open so now you can see you have gotten it here okay so we can now take a look and go into plugins you see the ones you have installed here PTH 200 environmental sensors is here and the only thing you need to set up is the installation directory it makes a bit of a guess here and it found it so you don't need to set anything otherwise you just click set folder here you can see right away the temperature and, uh, and the pressure and uh, the humidity that it reads so now you go to options and then uh, horsepower correction and as you can see now we have three different different options here use built-in sensor data that's the sensor inside the box or use the plugin sensor or you can manually enter data as before so if we swap now to the plugin um, then you can see some slight changes in the numbers here the and overall environmental factor didn't change much about 0.3 percent maybe that will of course be more if the sensors are further apart uh, and uh, in the, the Yordyna box is inside, is inside a cabinet for example Anyway, now you can choose external environmental sensors if you want. I hope you like it.